still a ways off before Fayette County schools start in person classes, but they are still planning for what that will look like amid a pandemic. And this morning we're zeroing in on school buses and how the district plans to make the ride to school safe. Kristen Edwards is live at Lansdowne Elementary School in Lexington this morning with the plan for returning safely back to school. Chris and Claire simply hopping on a bus and heading to a school like Lansdowne Elementary here is a thing of the past. As it stands right now, students will be required to wear face masks, social distance and get their temperature checked twice, once by a parent and another time by a bus monitor all before they can get on a bus. This is according to Fayette County Public Schools routing supervisor Brad Daniel and for parents who may not think that is enough. Daniel said it's important to remember by that by the time in person classes resume, schools will be operating at reduced numbers. Increased cleaning and the fact that community spread will be lower by the time kids physically go to school should also make buses safer. And for kids who do not follow the rules, there will be consequences. When we have a student discipline issue, that's not something transportation takes care of. That's something that the school does. Um, but, you know, that is a possibility that you would lose the right to ride the bus, you lose the privilege to ride the bus. For this to work, the Fayette County School District says that there has to be buy in from all parties. That includes students, teachers, parents and bus drivers. Live in Fayette County, Kristen Edwards, LX 18 News.